wherever you are. Now we are going to the special award, which is for dedication and valor. And guess who it is? Former captain of the Black Stars, the man who's called the El Capitano, Stephen Tornado Apera. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for him. Let's hear it for him. Stephen Tornado Apera going into the history books as a man the first captain to qualify Ghana to a World Cup. Let's hear it for him, ladies and gentlemen. He does deserve this honor. And the citation reads, You represent the true definition of loyalty, commitment, and dedication to the cause of a nation. You are an inspiration to your colleagues through the quality leadership you provided the Black Stars who spared the nation unto success. Appear truly, Personally, I miss you as a captain of the Black Stars. Congratulations, Capitano. You really deserve this award. Distinguished invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, shall we put our hands together for Black Star striker, Asamoah Chan. The baby Jets, they call him. He scored all those breath-hopping goals at the World Cup. We do remember that penalty. We do remember that one he scored against the United States of America. We do remember the strength he showed when he came back into a pulsating penalty shootout after missing one to score. Let's hear the citation. You joined the Black Stars in 2003 with a lot of promise, and you have since then lived to expectation by contributing immensely to success of the team over the past seven years. The success of the team cannot be documented without giving the due recognition to your great role on the field as a goal coacher and a German leader, a German leader in the dressing room, which provided a lot of inspiration to your colleagues. At the 2010 World Cup, Nation Cup in Angola, where you made a great comeback and helped the team to reach finals for the first time in many years. And at the 2010 World Cup in South Africa, to many, you were a hero, to some you were a villain. However, we commend the very soft spot in hearts of many fans with your specially endowed talent. On the turf, you exhibit a great skill combined with amazing speed, which leaves your opponent in a state of fear, and your superior aerial ability cannot be underestimated. Over the years, you have succeeded in netting 26 goals out of 48 matches. You have indeed made the nation proud and demonstrated the spirit of a true sportsman. Patriotism, commitment to the cause of a nation. Call him the baby dead. It's official. He is the footballer of the year, 2010. Congratulations, Asamoah We are indeed proud of you. Ladies and gentlemen, coming up very shortly as well will be the Footballer of the Year and the Sports Personality of the Year. Let's all remember that it's a very tight, tough 
big competition between four distinguished sportsmen who surely have shown a lot of class over the sporting year of 2010. And the winner is Mumuni Abubakar. He played Niwe Dubiase, played over 30 games, an exceptional player by all standards. If you follow the league, you would know that this player deserves this award. Mumuni Abubakar. Diyasi. Please put your hands together for Mumuni Abubakar of New Edubiase Football Club. Congratulations. Congratulations, Mooney Abubakar. New Edubias is only in their second season, the Premiership. We hope that you are able to help them to do better next year. Congratulations for playing so many games and remaining the best player on the local scene. Congratulations. Indeed, Swag is proud of you, and we are hoping that soon you you. Distinguished invited guests. A free kick to Nio Dibiasi. Gullit. We're going to get a return ball. Well, the referee goes down. And the referee says play on. I think he, he, he more or less threw himself to the ground on that occasion. Anyway, Dibiasi still keeping possession. Doing it. Maybe, maybe the referee decided that when the header was taken, it actually went out before it hit the post. But uh, hearts of oak have to be careful. And New York has to keep possession very well. Mumuni. Oh, decided to blast that ball, went on target. And New York have not been overawed in this match at all. Touched the referee and uh, could so easily have been sent off for that. Well, Bremen so could be using her discretion to balance the acts here or balance the moves here for that earlier decision not to award the penalty. But I think that sometimes you need to let some of these things go, or you need to maybe keep their back. Idris Yaya. Mumuni. Yeah, to be asked, looking to create some space. Steven Menu has certainly been a thorn in the flesh of the Haas defense. Make no mistake about that. Mumuni. Play from the bench rather than have confrontations with them. And now. Steven Menu. Mumuni. Steven Menu. Steven Menu. Goes past one man, goes past the second. A shot. Good take there by Xavier Day. Well, Christopher, you. I'm lost for words here. Lou Edubias is doing everything right. The cross from the left, you would think that. It is a wasted opportunity. They bring it inside to Stephen Menu. He loses two markets. And then he sets up play so well. You look at it once again. He beats his marker. The next person comes, he beats him. All ends up and he allows Moro to have a good plan. And New Odibiasi just trying your best to. Well, let's still have the ball. Mumuni lays it off. Down the left. A cross comes in. But. Uh... control firmly done and it's then it's kicked out Some and uh, they're having to try and repel real Tamale United who really look uh, up for this match Mumuni the captain for New Edibiasi best okay. play for the far side the cross is on but RTU 
Mumuni Abubakari. Ball comes all the way back and it's back to the captain. Restarts the attack. Some 30 minutes in the second half. We have 15 minutes to go. And New DBSC are still leading by one goal. <laughs> Thank you. 